Hello, my name is uh, Alberto Square. I work at uh, the School of Finance and Management of SOAS University of London, where I'm convener of the MSc programs in Public Policy and Management, Public Financial Management, and I'm also convener of the Summer School in uh, Public Financial Management. The Summer School course uh, on Public Financial Management has been designed uh, with the idea to bring, uh, in a concise way, uh, some of the most interesting topics that we cover in our master's courses. So we cover issues of uh, where does the government take money, the money from, from for funding the operations, the decisions which are made for uh, funding public policies and programs, then how can the government be held accountable, how do they report to the public, and uh, what's the role of auditors in ensuring that public monies uh, are uh, properly spent. So we compress all these topics within a three-week course and we aim to provide the participants some insights into this important function for the working of the government. This program on public financial management is uh, different from uh, other similar courses that you can see around. Well, first it's a course about public policies, uh, how does the government make uh, choices uh, about funding programs and spending uh, public money. But it's not really a course about accounting or public finance. The key concern for us uh, is the decisions uh, which are made from the side of public, uh, public authorities. Uh, so it's more a course about uh, political science, if you like, or generally policy sciences. In addition to these, uh, we do not have any particular uh, uh, regional uh, focus. So we may look at uh, uh, countries from the developed world, uh, from uh, Western countries, uh, Europe and North, uh, North America, but we also place attention to emergent and developing countries, with the idea that some countries can learn from others' experiences, with the idea also that the local institutions uh, and culture and history and traditions also import, are quite important in uh, seeing how how the government makes use of financial resources. So the course uh, is uh, about lectures, but it is also pretty much about uh, classes or tutorials. Uh, so students will have the opportunity to interact uh, in uh, small groups uh, with their teachers and uh, with other course mates uh, and to discuss uh, specific uh, case studies. We also typically every year bring about uh, some uh, uh, new topics uh, which are around. So for instance, uh, what we plan to do this year is to have a look at the rise of uh, cryptocurrencies and some attention from the side of some central banks to use a central bank controlled or an issued a cryptocurrency and especially what does this mean in terms of public finances. So I hope to, to welcome many of you to come and study here at SOAS and London more generally. London, as you know, it's an international capital of the world and so here you can have the opportunity to interact with the people coming from all over the places. This can be the case especially of SOAS University of London because we have a huge variety of students coming from different regions in the world with different backgrounds and so typically there is plenty of opportunity to learn from each other's experience.